Some of the thousands of refugees now fleeing Syria could soon be coming to the United States. The European countries are asking the U.S. to step up and do its fair share. Your thoughts on whether that's a good idea in this morning's Say What? The images are heartbreaking. Syrian families risking death to escape almost certain death in their own country. Germany, Austria, England and other countries have pledged to resettle some of the millions of refugees and now they're pressuring the United States to take 10,000. I don't see why we would stop now. Walter says it's our history. Tired, poor, huddled masses like it says on the Statue of Liberty. I think they should get an opportunity just like any other immigrant trying to come to the United States. They should get their due process. I mean, this is the land of the free. The United States and Iowa stepped up in the past, welcoming refugees from Vietnam, Yugoslavia, and Russia. But on our Facebook page, Grace says, in the United States of America, we don't take care of our own people. How in the hell are we supposed to help others? Nedra says, I think if those young men and growing boys would stay in their own country and fight, then we would not have to take any in. But Barb posts, we have a lot more than most of the world. We should share what we have with those who have nothing. And Carolyn posts, I wonder how the vetting will ensure we're not laying the USA open to terrorists. It's a positive effort for mankind. People need help. That's why we're here. Sean says when you look at the scope of the Syrian refugee problem, 10,000 is probably too few. And the U.S. shoulders part of the blame. I think we probably should since we uh, stirred things up over the, with the Iraq war. We seem to have disrupted all the cultures and we're kind of hugely responsible for the mess that's going on now. You know, we always want to hear your thoughts. You can share your views on Syrian refugees in the United States right now on our Facebook page.